Andy runs forward. I think he is trying to get some harass Birdie, but look, look at, at this. That. Lina got level 3, she got stunned, and he's in big trouble. Oh, the salve. Dragon Slave, it's ready. <laughs> Clockwork with the Rocket Flare will actually secure the There's nothing. Oh, it's picking up the Courier. Oh, Dendi. He wanted the Courier Sniper. I'm just going to do a decent chunk of damage onto Iceberg. He's got LSA in two seconds' time. Always oh, going to fly. Walks in, and Dendi's in trouble here. Going to die again. You at least had the camera on that, right? No, at the very last second I saw his like corpse die, but that's a double kill going the way of Iceberg. When you factor in the fact that Storm and Juggernaut, both of them, are susceptible to the invis life strike rate, Dendi is not level 6 yet. The Fisher's good here, and Goretz is trying to get damage out and will do so. They find the kill on the Storm again. This snowball with the shots, they'll find a counter. Finally get themselves up on the board as Goretz yeah. does die to Funny. Yeah. They're, they're, still, they're still going. They're still going for this? PSM just caught in the ensnare to take down the healing ward and down he goes. FN is now trapped in the middle of three heroes. Glimpse back into the camp and that's him gone as well. Yeah, there's a, there's a real sense of... Uh, to me it kind of says there's a little bit of tilting happening. There's a glimpse that bit and then he's dead again. Oh boy. He is not worrying and it's actually just a return stack steal. That's what it is. Actually a clever move I think from Navi. But Unless then he's gonna die again. <laughs> in trouble top as well. Oh, you're right, they jumped into the hook shot. And he's got that good Fisher, Goretz. Oh, the tower aggro switched back to Artez. And Sinead Coach, you really want. Is he, is he, nope, no, he's not. Nero on his own. He needs a lot of backup. Oh, good snowball dodge. This is a kill here on Iceberg. It's massive for Navi. FN coming in. He's the Omni Slash, and there's the Mega Kill Street. He is, he is building towards the Soul Ring, which I think is the, the easiest cheap recovery item. The Tusk is going back in. Storm as well. Goretz has the hook shot, traps them onto the tower, but he's still dead. Static Storm, not going to catch them with the connected field. Glimpse back onto Dendi. And he's trapped here. They've got the net. They've got the damage. And he doesn't have the mana to fall lightning any further away. So what is the... I, I don't want to look at wind conditions here for Na'Vi because I think that's so far away. Oh, Dendi. Oh, Storm. Stun. Timed perfectly. Nope. Dendi still jumps forward and with the Omni Slash. Iceberg's dead. Sonic up the top and snared up. But it's snowboard, turn it back around. Punches up, always on a fly, and the fish comes in with the shards as well. Artez, he's burned through Phoenix Manor, but the hook shot off the mark. Oh, he's still on cooldown. I thought maybe they'd throw it and try and find one, but they get the kill regardless. Grumps back in cogs. Get the kill on Snakeo as well. For some reason, I thought I heard to see who's behind. Get the kills on the back end. All right. Locked in here and now he's trapped in the hook shot across but dodged out Static Storm catches two with a connect field as well. They're all trapped inside sub the ward finally dropped out by PSM but Dendi, Dendi ball right again. He's gonna kill off fan score here. The song at the very, very end. Let's take a look at this. Always wanna fly, gonna die here possibly to the sub but ward. Dominic Slash jumps onto Artes and he can't blink away. Iceberg doesn't even kill PSM and this is absolutely disastrous here for CIS rejects. They'll kill off. Iceberg, if Dendi's got enough mana and he does, one hit out, should be able Next to secure thing. this. The strength of the enemy picks, well, Iceberg will probably get Dendi's Aegis here. I think it's They've just the Aegis. Shot. I don't think he gets this. I think Goretz could time this. Yep, he's got it. Life Strike Array, land Laguna Blade, they've got it. Perfect! Absolutely. Oh, he's moved now. Flicks away, the Static Storm drops, but... He can't just yet. Serve the water down, but you'll step to Iceberg, but he's got PSM. And he will zap him into oblivion, so one for one, full for support, but Tusk Snowball works still up at the top lane though. And Na'Vi are not pausing. Fair, they don't have to, Song and Siren. They've set this up nicely. Suneko has Echo, that's something they have to be very wary of. But they've trapped two in the cogs. Life Strike Raid not going to land here, it's a zip zap Snowball as well. Echo landing down onto three. Suneko is dead and Funny's going to fall straight out. The only slash on the back, going to get tanked up by the Lina, but she yields us up into the air. FN. Dropping incredibly low as the Vortex, as the Remnants, as all the loose damages is coming out of Dendi. Does finish off the Lina at long last, but he's hunting the Courier, and this is really a wild goose chase. He's got no mana left, he can't even TP away, and that's going to be his doom. So CIS Rejects, once again, yeah, like, so like, it like that's what I'm saying. Like, independent, oh, he's still jumped on here with the stuns. Song of the Siren. Have they got five man? No, four man. Kinetic Field, Static Storm, only gonna catch Dendi though, really here. FN as well, no, they've got them both. Laguna Blade finished him off, and Dendi, Glimmer Cave up now, Invis hiding under the Serpent Ward. The Echo Slam out, they've got the Hulk across as well. Funnick is caught, but the Mana Void not doing a damn thing. Artez is microed, but 
It's just not strong enough. They've lost three of their heroes. Artes trying to fight Suneko, but he's being right hooked down and finished off by Funic. Got that five man wipe there. Let's rush out. It is a Naga on the Well, Antimage just dies instantly. Always want to fly. Gets the song! Except he zapped Naga into oblivion. So Roshan died. But CIS rejects. Have they got a gem? Oh, Storm. Jumps on the Naga Siren. Gem is over on the Lina. Oh boy. The Echo Slam. Static Storm's been dropped, but Dendi gets himself out. The Fisher will lock them. Drop to Naga, gone, and this Omni Slash is huge. Funic just jumped forward and gets the kill there as well. Even with the Mana Void down, Artes, five man wipe once more. Just stall it out and try and <laughs> get, Artes, get Artes to fix his problems for game three. Yep, I definitely see that being a highly likely possibility. Is it against Empire, is that right? Yeah, against Empire. Oh dear. Tusk. The, the, the clock was just low. Tusk didn't even use his DDS. Now he uses it, goes in, and solo kills the Naga. Oh, Artes. So this is <laughs> look at look at no, dude, look at Van score, honestly. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Yeah, they're just they they're taking their time because whatever Art is dealing with is taking time to to deal with. And in the same way, you said it's fair enough for Navi not to pause Flim. I think it's fair enough for Sky's rejects to do this too. Dyer's top if this is what it's come to. <laughs> Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Oh my goodness. Well, <laughs> oh god, the couriers are coming! The little donkeys! The donkeys are on their way. Oh, I don't even think the team fight matters as much as the donkeys dying. Like, <laughs> son of the siren. He's gonna get popped here. Dandy just cleaning up hands. So. It has been a travesty of a series. Like series one to one. The GG's have not been called yet. The throne has yet to die. There is no comeback chance here from CIS Rejects though. <laughs> Even when the Beyond Gold Lake Street gets uh, taken out there. Iceberg has no items. Always want to fly, still playing seriously. But uh, the anti mage with 5,000 gold can't spend any of that. Um, yeah, I mean, they've, they've already Dyer's asked to postpone game three. He brings the protection, then at some point he went to Mangoes, and sometimes when they're on the winning team, he's not near, he's like killing the enemy base, he's not close enough to the shop, and then he just drops all his items on the ground. Yeah. But he likes to screw with the stats, that's why.